welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing fantastic. I know Lita is. Lita actually got a promotion and she is now a file clerk. Uh, so we're doing really, really well at our job. And we also have been doing really well with keeping things nice and clean in the apartment. The problem is there's some sort of something that is dirty or something somewhere. I have no idea where it is, what's causing the problem, but she keeps getting this moodlet down here that says like filthy surroundings. But I have looked everywhere. I've moved out all of the furniture. I've done all the things, guys, and I can't find anything that would lead me to believe that there was any kind of issue. I don't know. Like, I just keep looking around, looking for, like, maybe plates that have been, like, stuffed somewhere they shouldn't have or um, something like that. But I'm just, I'm not seeing anything. And like I said, I've already moved out all the furniture um, and things like that. So, I don't know. It's really starting to aggravate me because it constantly puts her in a bad mood every time she walks into her living room area and I'm really just not feeling it so not sure what the problem is there but it is Saturday unfortunately it is rainy <laughs> uh, but I think we are going to kind of go out exploring and see if we can meet some new people um, and just kind of spend the day out of the house because honestly I think your girl really needs it she's been working really hard this outfit looks so cute on her you guys oh and I forgot to tell you our little tiger buddy arrived from the sanctuary um she loves it she's absolutely obsessed with it it is so cute she named it snow and it's a adorable you can pet the cat somebody let the internet know brb adding it to my simstagram story right now <laughs> okay girl well while you're adding things to your simstagram story let's go out and do something actually worth adding Okay, so we decided to get with Ty and come down to the Screaming Gecko. Let's have them come in here and sit together before they get soaked from it raining outside. Um, but while we're here, we obviously want to order some drinks. So let's order drinks for group. Um, we don't want to do anything too expensive. Um, let's just do a couple of vodka sodas. So while we're waiting for our drinks, let's uh, kind of get to know Ty a little bit. Let's maybe bestow empathy and have a deep conversation. Maybe we'll ask about her taste in music. I just kind of want to get to know her a little bit. Hey, hey, jerk face, that's not for you. You leave that drink alone, that's for my friend. Hey, that's not for you. <laughs> Leave my drink alone. Oh my gosh, people keep taking our drinks. <laughs> oh, that was like in tandem. What they do, take a shot together? My goodness. <laughs> okay. So upstairs at the Screaming Gecko, it doesn't look like they have a whole lot going on. Uh, downstairs seems to be where all the Sims are at. This seems to be where the party is. <laughs> there's also a little outdoor area here, which is pretty cool. And there's a hot tub out here. Um, do we want to get in the hot tub? I mean, we could. I also want her to take a picture with Ty. Her and Ty seem to be getting along so, so well. And I think that she really likes hanging out with Ty. Ty seems like a really cool person. Okay, let's see if we can get a cute picture of her and Ty. Oh my goodness, look how cute they are. Oh my gosh, you guys, too stinking cute. Okay, um, I think we are gonna get in the hot tub. I mean, why not? Let's have them go get in and just hang out in the hot tub. Okay, well, it doesn't look like Ty is interested in getting in the hot tub, so... Uh, your girl here has decided that uh, she's gonna go ahead and get out. Let's have her change her outfit back into the one that she was wearing. 
And I guess since nobody has claimed this screwdriver, we'll take that. Oh, now Ty gets in the hot tub. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> All right, I think we are going to go ahead and disband our group here. And I think Lita wants to go check out the park. Okay, so I guess this is the park, the garden. Um, I mean, the statue is really cool, I guess. Um, but there's really not, <laughs> I don't know, I guess there's just really not a lot to do i mean you just gonna sit somewhere you can grill which it looks like she's doing unless she was just cleaning it yeah she was just cleaning it <laughs> um oh look we found a little collectible over here let's go grab that oh and there's a little frog there so i mean maybe you can find a few little collectibles here and there um but other than that, I'm not I'm not overly impressed with the with the park. I, I think it's kind of pointless. That I think this lot really could have been used for anything else. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just I'm not sure that I'm really I'm really digging this this lot. It just it seems pointless to me. I don't know. I don't know. You guys will have to let me know what you think about the. Uh, about the park lot do you guys are you, i'm gonna replace this with something else i'll tell you right now i'm going to replace this lot with something else probably some kind of actual park or some kind of um like retail market or something um because i'm never gonna use this the way that it is it's about 3.30 in the afternoon and Lita has just arrived home. So she's going to come in and use the bathroom. And then honestly, she really doesn't have much of anything else she needs to be doing. Um, so I think what we'll have her do is we'll have her do a little bit of work. We'll have her uh, file some court documents and uh, kind of get that started so that she doesn't have to worry about it for Monday. And then maybe what we'll do is we'll have her come out and and put a little dinner in her pressure cooker crock pot thing so it's about six o'clock so it did take quite a bit of time for her to finish up with those court documents um, but she's feeling pretty good now um kasim is calling and he wants to know if we want to go to a, a talent showcase down at the solar flare um so yeah i guess i guess we will so the first thing I want to do is I want to ask Kasim if he's single because if he's not single, we really don't need to be here with him. <laughs> yeah, he's married to Nin. I I just don't know that it's appropriate for us to be here together then. So let's do this. Let's um, let's just disband the group because I feel like that's a little bit inappropriate, you know, for you to be asking me to come out with you when you're married um but ooh, ooh kyle kyleson's here i mean uh, he's shirtless and i could definitely see her having a little bit of a fling with kyle kyleson however <laughs> i don't know that i really want to do that i think what we're going to do is we're probably just going to head back home um and I think we're gonna <laughs> we're just gonna pretend that this never happened <laughs> so she just got home she's sorting through some of her junk mail um and it doesn't look like she has anything super important or anything to worry about so she's finished with that and then she's gonna go ahead and come inside and finish prepping that dinner that she never started so everything's good we have that cooking uh let's see if we can maybe just go change into our pjs so we can change into some nice comfy clothes and maybe we will watch the cooking channel for a while kind of work on that cooking skill a little bit Oh, it looks like our dinner is done. So we need to go ahead and come release the steam vent. So I believe this is an Instapot or like a like some kind of pressure cooker. Um, let's go ahead and grab all servings. 
Ooh, okay. So this looks like mango sticky rice. Okay, so it looks like maybe this is normally had as a dessert or a morning meal, uh, but it looks like she's gonna have it for dinner. It's fine, no judgments. Girl, you eat what you want when you want. Uh, so once she's done with that, I think she's gonna come in and just kind of channel surf for, for a while. Everybody needs to just veg out every now and again. Now that she's done channel surfing, um, it looks like she's going to kick back and watch the news for a little bit, watching the 10 o'clock news, you know, before she heads off to bed for the evening. Our girl is up bright and early first thing this morning. It's just who she is as a person. Um, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, let me know by leaving a like on the video and leaving a comment down below. It really helps me out. We've seen a lot of channel growth here recently, and I am so, so thankful for that. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. It really does mean a lot. So, um, yeah, I think we're going to go ahead and call this episode Dunzo and we'll pick up in the next episode um later so yeah okay i'll see you guys next time bye guys mm -hmm.